Welcome back to Pennsylvania Outdoor Life. You know, we're talking about trophies. And let me tell you, a kid's first bluegill is a trophy. Maybe all, you, all that anybody caught their whole lives are fish like this. The next big fish, a trophy. We like sharing photos of people's trophies with you. We call it Pennsylvania People and Places. We'll begin things this morning with some successful trout fishermen from Bloomsburg and the trout that they caught during last year's opening day of the trout season. First we see Robert Hawk II and the limit of trout that he caught using salmon eggs. Robert's father, Buzz Hawk Sr., managed to catch a couple of nice trout using spinners. Dave Nakowski limited out on trout using the tried and true power bait method while Ron Gensel took Buzz's advice and put his trout on the stringer using spinners. All of these guys landed their trout on the opening day while fishing in Lycoming County. Check out Dylan Saltzman of Pittman and his very first deer and what a deer it is. Dylan is seen here with the 11 point buck that he shot on the first day of the rifle season while hunting with his father Randy in Upper Mahantongo Township. He downed this beautiful buck using a Savage 308. Next we see Lisa Reich of Mifflinburg and the buck that she shot on the opening day of the rifle season while hunting with her daughter Carrie Reich and family member Dylan Starr. Lisa's buck had nine points and a 20 inch spread. She shot her buck with her grandfather's 32 Winchester Special and they were hunting in Wildlife Management Unit 4D. Here are brothers Connor and Brady Shea of Shikshini and the bucks that they shot on the opening day of the rifle season. 17 year old Connor's buck on the left had seven points while his brother Brady's buck, which is his very first, had eight points. The boys both shot their bucks with the Winchester 308 while hunting in Herrick Township, Susquehanna County. And they were hunting with their dad, Jamie, and Uncle John. Next we see 13-year-old Brianna Lewis of Proctor and her very first buck. Brianna's buck sported six points and a 16 and a half inch spread. She downed her first buck using a 243. Way to go, Brianna. And here's another youngster in the buck that she shot while hunting with her dad. Avery Salisbury of Wyalusing is seen here with the 10 point buck that she shot on the opening day of the gun season and she too was using a 243. Next we see Benjamin Nye of Danville and his very first buck. Benjamin is seen here with the 8 point buck that he shot while hunting with his grandfather in Montour County. He shot his first buck using a 7mm08. Congratulations on your first buck, Benjamin. Here's Don Holly of Wilkesbury in the buck that she shot on December 2nd, right before dusk off of her mother's farm in Susquehanna County. Don's buck had eight points and was shot with the 308. She also managed to harvest two doe during last year's rifle season. Way to go, Don. Take a look at the huge buck that Nate Knobholtz of Cressona shot while hunting with his father Len in Schuylkill County. Nate's buck had 14 points and a 20 inch spread. He shot it with the Remington 30-06 while doing two man deer drives. We'll end things this morning with 80 year old William Judge of Dallas and the buck that he shot on December 2nd. He was hunting in Luzerne County. Williams Buck sported seven points and a 19 and a half inch spread. That's a great buck, William, congratulations. And with all of our successful sportsmen out there, we'll put a close to this week's edition of Pennsylvania People and Places. Thank you very much for sending in your photos. And of course, we want you to keep sending them to us. Trout season's along the way. If you did some ice fishing, send those photos to us. Turkey season. And be sure to check them out on WNEP.com slash POL. And if you want to submit it, very easy. Hit the slideshow and follow the instructions. We're going to take a short break and we'll be right back.